Welcome back YouTubers to the final Elden Ring boss fight video. I'm gonna be using the magic broadsword level 25 and uh, I'm gonna use my mimic tear ashes. So yeah, it's very the mimic uh, summon is the best summon you can get. It it mimics your fight and everything. So yeah, that's the best uh, I in my opinion and that's the best summon in Elden Ring. So yeah, I'm gonna show you how I killed this boss. Or it's a two-part boss, Radagon of the Golden Order. Be sure to summon the Mimic and dodge here. Uh, beware of his stabbings and use the, the stomp, the ice stomp. This one is very eff effective against uh, the final two bosses. And uh, yeah, your mimic, uh, your mimic summon is yeah, the, he's so awesome. I, I got him very late in the game, so yeah, he was. It's very good. He's and he is the same level as you, or you can level him up and make him very strong. I think I had him at level seven. I think it's yeah, if you if you can uh, level him up like to level ten or fifteen. But yeah, I just use the stomp here. And he goes down very fairly fast. It's uh, my issues with this boss. The final boss was the the last one. He is is more difficult in my opinion. So yeah, it's the Elden Beast, I presume. Yeah, Elden Beast. So this one is much more difficult in my opinion. Uh, the first one was uh, much easier to kill, but this one. He does so much damage and he, he throws so much things, uh, magic against you. But yeah, uh, be, sh be sure to use your frost damage. And uh, if you're out of uh, magic, then you can use your sword as a last resort. But yeah, he's gonna try to kill your mimic. And uh, while doing that, just go on the back and use your frost damage. Now he will swim down like the fish he is now he's gonna shoot like lightning thingies from his sword so be sure to dodge these roll roll out of here okay now he's gonna shoot he's gonna do this one this damage okay now I need some potion he almost got me there okay use the stomp damage I didn't hit him okay just get a bit closer now he's gonna fly up if you know guys uh, how to avoid this damage I I think I have I've managed to avoid this damage once yeah you can run on the outside of the circles but if you're in this inside he's gonna yeah and this this uh, that spell he does you just need to run away he's gonna explode and right in your nose so yeah and this uh, this combo as well yeah Luckily you have your Mimic, so he's gonna hit your Mimic. Try to get close to him and use your Frost damage. Yeah, he just uh, flies away all the time. He's so annoying. You're gonna try to get close to him, but yeah, he's so in the pain in the behind. So yeah, here. Okay, here. He's probably gonna get me. Yeah, okay, it didn't take that much life. I, I think it was for the Mimic, yeah. That's why he didn't take any life from me. Okay. Get close. Use the magic. Use the stump. As you can see, you take a lot of life with this stump magic. Okay, remember to dodge these swords. These uh, strikes, I mean. My bad English. Okay, use the stump again on the back. Watch out for the swing here. Use the stomp. Stomp him down in the ground where he came from. So yeah, without this stomp and my mimic summon, I I don't know if I could kill him. Probably you guys have killed him with different tactics. Let me know in the comment section what what weapon you use or what type of magic or yeah. I will be it would be interesting to know what people how people killed him so yeah this circle of life now I don't know I don't know if it can 
run away from it here. Let's see. No. You're supposed to run on the outside, I think. And these ones, uh, you just dodge all the time. Back and forth. They're not gonna hit you. Okay, get close to this. I don't know what to call him. He's the beast. What kind of a... What kind of monster is he? He's... It's like a fishy. Something fishy. Okay, now the explosion got me. Take some potions. I have only one potion left, so... Yeah, now it's these ones. You need to dodge, run. Back and forth like this. And now he's gonna do these strikes. Yeah, be ready to dodge here. He's so far away, you need to run all the time. And when you get close to him, he's just gonna fly away like the fishy he is. Yeah. Okay, now I need to hit him, I think, twice more. That's one, two, and he's dead, guys. I think this game was so awesome. I was so addicted. I played like, I think my total time of this game was like, 150 hours let me know how many hours you played this game it was so addictive i i almost played it every day it was so awesome i think in my opinion one of the best games in uh, 2022 so yeah after you kill him you can touch this uh, his ashes and stuff and it's gonna yeah it's a spoiler alert if you don't want to see the end just uh, pause the video but yeah, let me know if you think what you think of uh, the boss fight and uh, if I helped you out in some way. If you don't like the video, let me know as well. I was I will try to improve my my talking skills. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> okay. See you in the next gaming video. Have a nice one. Bye-bye.